Greetings and welcome back to Imperion Alpha 11. All right, I am in my base right now, and yes, I have a toilet and a shower because I'm not a barbarian. I also have an oxygen dispenser, which is the reason my oxygen is full, and uh, an armor box up here, which I'm hoping to find some boosts today. I'm actually hoping I can get a better suit of armor. That would be awesome. All right, um, in the meantime, I have been busy. I have been busy. As you can see, I have a lot of iron, a lot of copper, and silicon. The other ones aren't a problem. For silicon, I went back to the uh, area around the large wreckage where we were, and I emptied that one out. It's gone. It's empty. So I need to find more of it if I am going to get more of it, right? All right, and uh, I have a plan. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a small vessel. I have the stuff loaded in already. We're going to make a small vessel so that I can make a small vessel. Allow me to explain. There is things that I need in order to make a small vessel with a warp drive. That will get me to the next planet so that I can gather materials so I can make a capital vessel. Even just a minor one, right? But I have to get to the moon because the moon has what I need to make the warp drive. It has one... It has cobalt, which is you have to have in order to make the warp drive. The other thing is you need to have pentaxit. Now, I do have some already. I got some inside the irradiated area, but nowhere near enough. I need more of that. I can get that better on the moon. I'm also hoping I can get some more promethium. By more, I'm hoping I can get promethium, because I don't have any at the moment, and I kind of need it. I mean, I know where I can get it. Where is it? Um... There, remember that one? Yeah, but that's that's all kinds of ugly right there. I'm hoping maybe we can do something about that today. All right, first things first. Let's make our uh, our first small vessel and uh, our disposable one, right? All right, so let's do this. Let's make, oh, where is he again? I decided to go with this one. Let's go into the factory. I already have the stuff loaded. Because it has the cobalt and moon in its name. And I thought, yeah, that's kind of what I want. All right. And then I am going to spawn it. All right. Just put it here. Drop on the ground. All right. So this guy will suit my purposes. So let's get inside and suit him up. All right. First things first. Oxygen. Fill. All right. Second thing. Manage fuel. 19. I only have 19? I think I have more than 19. Uh, let me switch over to the base for a moment. And then not the refrigerator. Let's go over to here. Yeah, I'm just going to take that with me. Because, all right. Um, I think a couple of oxygens too. I think I noticed I used up my big oxygens. So we'll just do that. All right. And now I'm going to switch back to Cobalt Moon and then Fuel. And then we're going to drop the rest of this in here. Okay, that should be good. I, I really don't want to use my Promethean packs unless I have to, right? All right, now I'm going to switch over to the ammo container, and I'm going to drop a 1,000 rounds of 15 millimeter. And then we're going to break out, and then I'm going to load them. All right, I'm going on a heist. I'm going to steal from aliens, and they're not going to like it. All right, there's an unknown artifact here. I am going to waypoint that and remove on approach. There's also another one down here, right? I'm not going to mark that one just yet. Who knows? I may not survive the first one. All right, probably will. All right, let's just go in here and start heading in that general direction. All right, let's go. Even out. And view from behind. Obviously, this is much faster than uh, a hover vessel. As a matter of fact, that other hover vessel... His usefulness is probably gone now. Um, the next hover vessel I will get will probably be maybe a driller, or I might just go for a combat one, or maybe a combination of the two. Uh, that one, not necessary anymore, right? He's fulfilled his usefulness. All right, so this is an unknown artifact of alien manufacturer. And um, it has loot, and it has a booby trap. All right, so let's just try to slip in here now. Hold on a second. All right, so let's just get in close, really close. 
as in like touching it right here. All right, you see the container right there. You figure, oh, no problem. Just go on and grab it and there'll be no problems whatsoever, except of course for the booby trap. When I step on that, things are gonna happen. And I need to get back in the ship immediately, right? So here's what we're gonna do. And I'm gone. Okay, just you? Should be more than just you. Oh, you did you just, okay, where are you? Okay, so you stand right there, that's kind of awesome. Okay, no, 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 all right, hold on. That is a nightmare. It's aptly named. Please pay attention to how much abuse it's taking before it dies. Yeah, um, facing those guys face to face is not a good thing because they will do all kinds of things. All right, I noticed that only he spawned. Maybe I need to step in a little bit further here. Hold on a minute. Unless they're actually, I don't see anything else there. All right, hold on. Okay. Okay, in, 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 all right. I know they slipped there too, okay. Okay, is everybody on the ground? He's not on the ground. I could really leave them alive, but why would I ever do such a thing, right? If for no other reason, Can you just die, please? Seriously, he's a little bit alive. Were you hiding underneath the other guy? Okay, there we go. Okay, I do believe that that's all of them dead, right? Two nightmares and two of those little arachnid dudes, which are very scary. They will do very bad things to you in melee. All right, so, okay, what do they call this thing again? Hold on a minute. Uh, alien scorpion. Ooh, yummy, yummy. All right, this is why I'm here. Please be worth it. Okay, laser rifle. Not worth it. No, no. Minigun is okay. A lot of pentatsu. That's good. Pulse laser. How's my inventory going up? Okay, um, this... Does this one have ammo in it? Hold it a minute. Let me just, uh... Put the cooling gut over here. Hold on a minute. Um, oh, that has ammo in it. Does the laser rifle have ammo in it? Yes, it does. It's just that I'm a long way from being able to make ammo for that. And I think I have some minigun ammo back at the um, back at the base. The big thing is I did get a lot of pentatsit, um, which is good. Because that means I, when I go to the moon, I'm not going to have to worry about that. Because it is actually heavy. Watch, if I pick this up, notice 319 at the bottom there, right? If I pick it up, it's 181. So that's actually kind of heavy. All right, so I'm actually, it's heavy enough that I might want to Wi-Fi it back into my uh, base. So we're just going to go ahead back to the base before we go off to the other one. I was really hoping, though, that I would get something a little bit more useful. Um, a pulse gun a pulse rifle would have been more useful in terms of weaponry because it's pretty powerful and i can i can make the projectile rounds for it pretty easily right all right so all i have to do is get like nearby and i should be fine right wi-fi all right all right let's just uh do this all right cobalt moon let's go to oh wow i only have 90 rounds i guess it's it's got a lot of guns i think it has four cannons to it so they all filled up all right, hoarder, and then input. Okay, move that over, move that over. You know, I don't have the other one. All right, I'm gonna keep the two weapons for now, just because I don't wanna worry about moving it around. All right, so let's uh, go after the other one. I'd really like a better suit of armor. I'd really like that, that'd be awesome. All right, let's hear. Now there's other things in this area. There's only one that I'm really interested in. 
All right, so let's, uh, other than that, of course, I mean. All right, so let's go. That's like a mile and a fourth, mile point four. But we're moving pretty quickly here, so it's not that big of a deal, right? All right, same principle, same thing, right? I have to make more ammo for this. I don't want to take this into battle, if at all possible, because it's got no armor on it. Um, it actually doesn't have a lot of iron in it. Um, so the thing is that I'd rather, if I can get the jump on something, that's fine. But if I can't get the jump on something, I do not want to engage. Um, once I get some Sathium, that's actually how you make like combat steel, right? But again, I'm going to need to uh, get to another planet for that. Unless I find it, which can happen. I mean, there could be some in this container. It's just, I don't think there'll be enough to actually uh, do the job. All right. All right, and let's just rotate a little bit here. All right. Okay, that should do it. Why is that not hitting anybody? Yeah, the guns are acting weird. Okay, level A! Yippee for me. You guys want to help me with some more experience? By the way, where's the other nightmare? Okay, that gave me some experience. These guys are a little easier to kill than the nightmares. All right, I'm missing a nightmare. You there? Okay, he might be on the ground or he might be hanging on an edge. Or maybe he didn't spawn. I don't see it. I also don't hear it, too. So it could be that it didn't spawn. Hold on. Just a little bit. Let's park right in here. All right. I'm thinking if it didn't spawn, minigun. There it is. Yeah, that guy took like a hundred rounds. They're just ridiculous. Okay, oh, I... Volume capacity? How is that volume capacity? Okay, I'm just a little buggy, I guess. Okay, um... I need good stuff! Oh my. Oh my, power. Okay, and Zacosium, oh that's very nice. No complaints, no complaints. All right, I'm getting out of here. Oh my, that just took care of a lot of problems for me right there. Um, see this thing here, um, if you look at it, it's radiation protection. You look down at the bottom here, it says heat protection, cold. Radiation protection is four, right? If you look at this guy, radiation protection is 16. It's also got better weather protection as well. Um, so that is very good. That is very good. Um, I can go on the... Um, although I do need to check over here. All right, so let's just see. The radiation protection means that I can go and get that Prometheum and it won't be a problem. Um, I won't have to worry about radiation. Now, this is a junkyard. So we're just going to land in the junkyard because I'm going to search these containers. Okay, so let's get out. Um, I don't think I'm going to run into anything alive over here. All right. Now, I don't think there's anything in here. There usually isn't. By the way, the crash shuttle is kind of like a player's starting place. It won't really do much unless you put a core into it. Not really useful. Um, where was the other ones? Uh, that is the uh, broken radar. Not useful at all. This one is useful. All right, first of all, let's switch to this and go into salvage mode. All right, and some steel. Okay, in we go. 
Yeah, I, would, they, I don't think this wing has anything that would be useful here. Um, there's no containers in here. And you know, if you, if you try to salvage this, it doesn't actually give you anything. Which doesn't make any sense. Now this will actually give you something. The radars, the radars are definitely worth um, salvaging at this site. So let's see here. It's going to give me... It's going to give me electronics. Some, they can give you like computers and um, lots of electronics. Here's another one over here. And two computers, right. So they can come up with some decent parts there. All right. All right. Now this is the one that really has the good stuff. So let's see. What do you got? Oh, oh, radiation boost. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, that's a food processor. I'm not making any food here. Uh, what do you got over here? That's an, okay. I think these are just the, uh, what about you? Ah, uh, Promethean packs. I will take them. I will definitely take them. I could really use some more boosts though. What do you got? Okay, and I got a multi-charge, which is not bad. Because I think, did I have, I have this. But I didn't have a charge for it. What, where, where is it? Oh, it currently does have ammo loaded in. All right. Um, so I could use that to really take things apart. Okay, we got another multi-charge. Because I need Promethium to make those. Okay, mechanical components. And that's an O2 station. I think that that's a plant. I'm not really sure what's up with the plant. But, uh, all right. So I did get um, a radiation boost mod. I was kind of hoping for something else, but then again, I don't know if I need it since I have the large armor, right? What that means is I can now go to the surface of the moon and it won't be a big problem. All right. I don't, I think there might be something in here. Hold on a second. Boom. I think this is just food mostly, which I would like to eat actually. All right. And here, antibiotic injection. Oh, that's very useful. Yes, absolutely. Especially when you're fighting things like that. They have all kinds of nasty things they can do to you. All right, and how do you spend fun? That's for growing. I'm just going to hold it. Oh, radiation. Okay, well, you know what? We're going to hurry here. Uh, a stomach pill. Indigestion? Not really. Emergency ration. All right, I'm out of here. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Okay, so here is what I want to do. Going back to the base. All right, where is it? Boom, 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 boom. Why? All right, we're going back to the base. We're going back to the base. Because what I need to do is I am going to equip the, um, the armor. I'm going to put that extra radiation boost in it too. And then I'm going to get me some power. Okay, I've dumped the stuff there, and now, of course, we're going to the locker here. And I'm going to put this one on. And it looks much better. All right, so I only have the one boost here, which will boost my protection against radiation. All right, so now I can handle 19 rads. Not a problem. I also have a lot of these, which are really good, but they're also kind of heavy. I guess it's not that big of an issue at the moment. I mean, it is, if you pick them up, they're like really heavy. So I don't really need to carry that many of them. We'll just maybe carry two in case, three in case I need them, right? I'm not putting those there though. Let's put them back into here. Use my logistics and we'll put them in there. Those are really good power. These guys here were giving me 30 power, right? If you look at it, one of these, 300 power. Probably fill the... Um, the what's the name of it up there? Oh, actually, do I need to carry that with me? Yeah, I just carry that with me for now. Uh, oh, I forgot to put the extra meat in the fridge. All right. Um, and this. And just check out the amount of oxygen it has now. The old one was like 380 at the bottom on the left. Now this one has 843. Much better. All right. Now, I feel safe enough to go after some uh, Prometheum. All right, so what we're going to do is, because I need, I want to have that power on hand. 
All right, so let's see. Okay, that's kind of loud fog, isn't it? All right, where am I going now? All right, um, I'm not, you know, not going to subject you to the full trip. So what we're going to do is this, and then this, and then I am going to go over there. It's probably a good distance away. Yeah, three and a half miles, but still, like I said, I'm not going to subject you to the entire trip. All right, we are approaching the Prometheum. And you can't even, with with the whole darn planet at the moment covered with this stuff, it's really hard to do. Is that spiders? Oh, oh, oh! That's bad. That's bad. Okay, um, yeah, Xerox doesn't like me for that. All right, so I was not paying attention because I was paying more attention because I saw spiders over here. Death to the spiders. You cannot damn, okay, sure I can. No, 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 now you die. All right, where are you? Okay, more death, good. All spiders should die. Uh, by the way, he might actually have something that I would want. So let's just be very careful. I don't want to be near the ground because there can be some ugly things around here, right? All right, let's see. And I'm out. And I am, come on, right there, right there. Power, two power coils is pretty good. All right, energy matrix. No, that's that's some that's some quality loot right there. All right, at least I can repair this thing now. All right, where is I'm sitting right on top of it, I think. All right, even out. All right, now let's take a look at where they are. I don't see them. Wait a minute. I do have. Oh, I have to have the drill in my hand. There we go, there we go. You see them, the blue outlines? Yeah, you have to have the drill in your hand, something that is gonna drill, and you also have the ore scanner. See, there's, the Prometheum is in chunks in the ground. All right. All right, let's do this. Okay, I'm high enough that it isn't gonna be a problem. I'm hopefully, I'm not gonna have any problems here. All right, the thicker the line, the closer they are, right? So let's just start going down here now. All right, so that one looks a lot closer than the other ones. And there it is. Okay, there was only 17, all right. This one looks like it's up next. And here it is. Okay, 47, that's very good. What do we got here? That's a big one. 59. All right, 59. Well, 59 is going to do all right. There it is. Okay, only 10 on that one. Can we see big ones? That looks pretty big. Let's do that. All right, what do we get? 28. Okay, well, there's another one underneath it. Okay, that was a 10, but it was a little one. There's a big one. 31. Well, big is relative, I guess. All right, and... Okay, I... I Okay, I'm, I, my inventory has got problems. Actually, I already have 200 of it. All right, can I... Uh, send that up there? All right, send that up there, send that up there. Uh, oh, that reminds me, though. I should go back to the ship. Let me go into the ship. All right. The reason I wanted to go into the ship is let's see about producing something here, right? Does this guy have a constructor? You know, I never even looked. He may not have a constructor. Equipment? No, I guess he doesn't. Well, to be fair, he doesn't actually have a... Um, 
a regular cargo box too, does he? All right, well he doesn't have that whole idea of mine went to uh, went to nothing there, didn't it? All right, well I dropped my stuff, so let's just uh, get back out, cause I ain't done yet. All right, so let's just uh, switch over here and don't knock myself off. That would go very badly. By the way, that fell because I couldn't carry it. All right, back in the hole. Because I was looking at something that was good. Yep, there we go, there we go. Although I'm starting to get a little too far away from myself. There is, okay, 62 is good. Another 34. Okay, 20. That's doing very well. Is that good enough for now? Let's just look around to see if there's anything that's big. Let me go back up the hole here. Um, how much did I get? I got only 30% of it. All right, well, can I, here, let's go to the surface. Let's go back to the surface and see if there's anything. Where's me vessel there? It's over there. Um, Okay, extra 32. Okay, and that was a big enough chunk that I couldn't carry it all. Which means it's probably on the surface. Alright, hold on a minute here. Yeah, it's sitting right there. Alright, where am I? Okay, can I do that uh, transfer again from here? Alright, yep. Okay, and then I have this. And back to this. 85. Okay, we got 500. That's going to do the job, especially considering I got a bunch of these. All right, so that is going to be good. I can make, uh, I don't have to use this little thing anymore for anything, actually, uh, because I have replacements for everything. I can get a better drill. I can use a multi tool. And of course, for weapons, I now have real weapons. Um, and I think that's going to be it. All right, so. Next stop is going to be the moon. So we'll probably make a trip to the moon in the next episode and uh, start working on getting to another planet. Speaking of another planet, let's just see what we have here. Uh, solar system, because I haven't looked at this. Okay, so here we are and our moon is right there. So this is the next world to get to. The distance is 3.3 AU. That's how much um, of the metaxit I'm going to need. Um, and of course, there's like a wormhole. Is that a wormhole? Yeah, don't go into the wormhole. Wormholes are one way only. So um, more of the solar system will become uh, visible once I get to the next planet. It's kind of like that. In order to see the next planet after this, you have to get to that one. And you know, But wormholes can be very dangerous because they only go one way and then you may not be able to get easily back to your original planet. Anyway, I think that's going to be it. Wow, there's a lot of radiation around, isn't there? A lot of radiation. But that's not my problem because I am very well protected. Okay, so like I said, next episode, we're going to the moon. So anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.